Let's do this, dude. Five hundred dollar total bet on cash or crash, man. Yo guys, it's your boy Fencer GG, and we're back with another cash or crash video. This video is gonna be a little bit different on it, and I'm mainly gonna be explaining well, not only how the game works, because a lot of people still don't understand it, even if they've seen my video. I try to do my best to explain it, but what we're gonna be doing in this video is showing you what I think probably the best money management strategy is for cash or crash because the whole idea of the game is to cash before you crash i'm going to be showing you a nice little money management strategy that basically ensures that you always get at least half your bet back if it's going decent uh or your base bet back basically this is a pretty good round we missed out on it so far my biggest my highest level ever was level 11 uh outside of that i've only gotten to uh i think i got to maybe level 10 one time as well so hopefully we can have a good play session here we're gonna be starting off on a 50 dollars total bet and we're gonna see if we can get some big wins off of that dude so if you guys have never seen this game before i'm gonna take a little bit of a moment to explain how it works so essentially the game's like crash if you've never seen crash before uh what happens is every green ball dude this is an insane round every green ball that hits the elevator or the blimp is going to keep on rising the multiplier goes up so this is a direct representation of what the multi would be on your bet so if you had 50 dollars down this would be like 355 or something like that okay it's over so the red ball automatically ends the round if you get that gold ball that you can see right there that will uh the gold ball actually makes it to where you are protected from red ball so it's impossible for the round to end until you've got two red balls if you get a gold ball and if the gold ball breaks that makes it to where green's got to be in if the gold ball breaks it makes all the green balls after that uh essentially raise up in value like you get higher multipliers you get way higher multipliers in the green ones Jeez, that was a little brutal here all right let's see what happens man let's see what happens so the strategy we're going to be going for is essentially a money management strategy and in my opinion it's the best strategy for this game so if you guys haven't seen this before when you get three rounds in you double your bet up to a hundred dollars or like if you're betting ten dollars you get twenty dollars once we get three rounds in three green balls in a row i'm gonna take half my bet so we ensure that we get at least our bet back and wow it pushed a gold ball off there so right now we could take half and we would have 40 dollars, even though we bet 50 or we could take all take the 80 we're not doing that we're continuing we're gonna go for another level here we need the hundred dollars we want the hundred dollars here we're gonna take half once we get a hundred dollars oh i can't tell if there's reds in there hey we got a green we'll take it man all right let's take half let's take half we're gonna play it safe we're gonna get our money back here we're gonna play it safe and this is all about a money management strategy guys in a game like this the number one thing that is gonna make your balance rise that is gonna make your wins more often uh look at that okay so we got our bet back perfect so we took half our money if i stayed in that i would have lost the whole hundred dollars i could have cashed out all of it technically uh but it's a we're, we're not let's do a hundred dollars man let's do a hundred dollars let's get let's get on a heater here as a nice little uh trend to starbucks dude trend to starbucks for you um but this is gonna basically key you in to get as as much gameplay as possible okay if you guys have seen my crazy time god strat videos or demon strats it is all about playing for as long as possible you want to have as much longevity as possible the more you're playing the more chances you are to hit a uh, higher multiplier the more chances you have to hit a higher multiplier because technically the more you're playing you know it's just the more more likely it's going to happen so the whole strategy was th with this is you're going to save a little bit this might be yeah i was looking like a red you're going to save a little bit more money throughout each round and then once you're saving that money and, and you're stacking that bread you're going to have the chance to actually hit one of those big multis or get one of those really high rounds uh so far in this session this is the last uh i believe it's 24 because i think this is eight yeah so 24 in the last 24 rounds the highest has got to is seven and that was uh that was the one we had just come in on uh so hopefully we can get something nice here i actually i don't know what the highest multiplier there has been yet I, i'd be interested to see that maybe track Cino, the site that tracks all the uh crazy time and live game stats will will put something out on that but uh let's get that gold ball man that gold ball's in there oh we got it okay since we have the gold ball we are completely protected from any future red balls nothing happens other than the shield breaks if we get hit by a red ball now 
If the red ball hits us and the shield breaks, uh, that might be a red. Oh, it's a green. Let's go. So if the gold ball hits or gets hit by a red ball here, the shield breaks and it'll make all the multipliers on the greens go even higher. So we're in the best position possible right now. We just need to keep avoiding reds. That's another green, guys. Let's go. 360 bucks so far. Oh, no, it's 270. That was weird. I don't know. I, I guess I can't count. Hold on. Come on. Let's get another green. Another green is 360. There's a red in there. Oh, my God, dude. What? My luck on this game is insane. Level 5 right now, and we still have a shield. This is going crazy. Give me a green ball again. Give me a green ball again. Oh, there's a couple of reds in there, dude. That's looking like a red. What? Guys, $500 is locked in. Dude, imagine if this keeps going. No way. Give me another green. Give me another green. Oh, there's a lot of... Yeah, yeah. So now... Uh, you know, this is rough here. This is rough. I say we let it ride, dude. We let it ride. This is going to be awesome. 67% chance to get a green here. Let's let it ride. I could have taken half, but uh, I'm looking for the gamble here, dude. Oh, there's a lot of reds in the middle. Oh! We just lost 500 bucks. We just lost 500 bucks. Okay. Okay. Uh, that is... That is... Uh, that's a good time. That's a good time. How about that? Wait, it's a good time, dude. Let's let's play a little more. Let's run a little more here. I think what we're gonna do is uh, we're gonna try to go for a little bit of a boost here. Okay, green. We're gonna try to go for a little bit of a boost here. Maybe get this balance up. And man, if we, if we can stay alive, get another get another couple rounds in, we might have to do some 200 250 dollar rounds, dude. I haven't done any massive bets on this game yet. So, I think doing some massive bets would be... Oh, that's a red. Yeah. I, I saw it in there. I saw it in there. I think doing some massive bets on this game could be, like, insanely lucrative. Let's let's just get right into it, man. I know this was a strategy-focused video. Damn, that gold was right there. I know this was a strategy-focused video, but I'm, you know, I'm what they call a gambler, dude. And when you're, when you're out here gambling... You want to take these risks. You want to do these big bets so you can bring home something memorable, dude. I always explain to people, you know, I'll be streaming over at twitch.tv slash fencergg. There was a little bit of lag there. I'm always streaming over at twitch.tv slash fencergg, dude. Shameless self-plug. I'm always streaming over there and people are telling me like, yo, can you play this slot? Can you play this slot? Can you play Voodoo Magic, Snake Arena? You know, these slots that can only get you a 1,000x. And I tell them, look, when I grow older, when, when my balls are sagging, dude, I'm not trying to tell my kid about uh dude you know we could take half here but <laughs> we're not gonna do that dude fuck the strategy we're gonna keep on going man let's let it ride anyway when my balls are sagging dude i'm not gonna be telling my kid about uh some fucking snake arena thousand x that's a red i'm not gonna be telling my little fucking fencer jr about some godforsaken thousand x on snake arena i'm gonna be telling him about the time i won 32k on crazy time i'm gonna be telling him about the time i hit a 1900 x on sweet bonanza i'm gonna be telling him about the 10,000 x i'm gonna be telling him about the 10,000 x i hit on book of shadows and i'm also gonna be telling him when i was five levels deep and fucking cash or crash with 150 dollars on the fucking table dude and we get a golden ball this late there's a lot of greens in there but there could be a red guys 750 dollars is safely locked in here next round is 1065 are you kidding me right now of course we get a highlight reel when i'm talking about my saggy balls dude come on that might be a red no way. 1,065 locked in, dude. Are you kidding me right now? Look at how fast this adds up, guys. Oh, there's a lot of reds there. Oh, do we take the thousand? Do we take the thou? Do we take the thou, dude? Oh, what do we do here? What do we do? We're going to continue, man. I was going to take half, but surely this is the one, right? Oh, there's too many reds in the middle, bro. Oh! 1575 do we take the 1575 or do we go for the 2400 i gotta take it man i gotta take it i gotta take it oh my god that looks like a red oh dude i would have had 2400 
beautiful 16x to the set above. What? I would have had 2400, dude. Let's see how high this went. That's crazy, bro. Meanwhile, decisions are made. Good luck. I would have had 36? This is how this game can get absolutely insane, guys. Look at this. You survived two more rounds on this high of bets, and you're at 9,300, dude. Good luck. Bro, I literally could have had 5,400. You gotta be yanking my chain right now, dude. You gotta be yanking my doodle. Are you kidding me? And because the shield broke, too, this... Oh, there's a lot of greens in there. Oh, my... Dude, I could have had 9,300, and I took a measly fucking 1,575. This is insane. This is the highest I've ever seen it, dude. Oh, there's a lot of reds. Oh! 9,300. Dude, there's no way. There's no way I could have let it ride that long. Let's do a $500 bet. What? No! It didn't accept my bet! No! Maybe that was for the better, dude. Watch it red on the first one here. No, there's a lot of greens. Dude. Oh, okay. Okay, I got saved. All right. <laughs> what, what do you say we do this one, dude? What do you say we do this one? Let's do this, dude. $500 total bet on cash or crash, man. This is so dumb. This is actually so dumb, man. Please, just gold ball me early, bro. Gold ball me early. It's bouncing too far outside. There's too many reds, bro. There's too many reds. I think I'm dead. Okay. Okay. We got to stay in, bro. 70% chance to continue. We got to stay in here. $500 total bet, dude. Are you kidding me? I'm so scared. Oh, the gold's early. Oh, no. It was in there and it got pushed out. There might be reds. Oh, dude. Oh, my God. I don't know what to do here, bro. I'm going to continue. I'm going to continue. Dude, I thought that was in there. Oh, please. Please get in there, gold ball. Oh, my God. He's like dead center, bro. Oh, my God. Should we take half? Let's take half. Let's take half. All right, $500. Letting the 500 ride, dude. Oh, there's a lot of greens in there. Oh, dude, what? 675 is what it's at right now. Oh my God, man. We'll go one more round. One more round and then we're taking all of it. Oh, there's a lot of greens in there, but there's also some reds. Oh my God, dude, 900. We could take half again. I say we take the 900, bro. I said, let's take the 900, bro. Let's fucking go. That's another 1,400. Are you kidding me? There's a lot of reds in there, but there's also some greens. Dude, damn, bro. This is, this is such a good game, man. I just love this game. Look at that. 1,400. Wow. That might be a red. There is a... Oh, my God, dude. Great session. I think her name's Emily. I've seen her a lot on Monopoly before. Yeah, it's Emily. Wow. Dude, what a cash out, man. Let's go. 3,000 total balance. Look at this. Dude, if I would have kept in my $500 bet, that would have been insane. So they're at level 8 right now. If I kept in my $500 bet, I, I, dude, I would have been at 5K. I would, dude, what? I would have been at 7.5K right now if I kept a $500 bet in. Oh, my God. Uh, we're, we're definitely calling the video here, dude. Wow, that's going to be a green again. Oh, my God. A level 10 again. Well, the strategy was successful, dude. Bro, this might go to max multi. So this, they are now, the players that are in this are now protected from a red ball. That's a green. Dude, this might literally go to max level. Look at that, dude. Look at how high this goes up. Oh, it just broke. So now you'll see all these numbers go up because the shield broke. Because it'll protect you from one of these late game balls. This is like now, see, I, I think when you get this far in, it's like, oh, there's so many greens. That's a red, that's a red dead center. Dude, this is the highest I've ever seen it go. 
Level 13. There's a green in there. Oh my god, bro. Dude, cash or crash, that's the best strategy, man. Take half your bet when you can. I, I don't really do that on stream, like, ever, because I'm a dumbass. Let's just face it, dude. I'm stupid, okay? And I, I don't do it often. I don't do it often. I don't. But that's that's what you have, dude. That's what you have right there. That is the absolutely insane potential of this game. If you guys like the video, make sure you leave a like. If you dislike the video, tell me to go fuck myself, dude. Um, but thank you so much for watching and drop a sub if you haven't already, man. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.